What's up everybody, it's Ronnie Barber doing film session presented by Microsoft Surface and sorry we're a little bit late. It's a bye week. We all kind of laissez-faire here this week. The Bucks did have a victory last weekend. Sunday at the Aints, I mean <coughs> Saints. 3-0 under Todd Bowles, by the way, against the New Orleans Saints. And there's a reason why. They're playing great defense. All right, first play. To me, this is the best and biggest play of the ball game. Now, what are the Bucks doing here? They are playing some sort of combo coverage. We know that there's two up here. There's a flat defender here. Izian is gonna go to a half defender. I'm not really sure what this guy's doing. It's like a third or maybe a middle run through. This is kind of a soft corner back here. But third and 16, the Saints are just looking for a sticks type of route. And what do I mean by sticks route? They want to go to the level of the, the first down and stop. So look at both of these outside wide receivers. They're gonna go here and stop, go here and stop. But this is also a read route by the middle third guy. This guy is gonna stop if this, if this safety stops here or if he settles his feet, which Antoine Weefield does, he's gonna keep running through the middle and watch this play. So, this could be a game changer. Up by eight at this point in the game, Derek Carr sees that his middle run through re receiver is gonna go right past Antoine Winfield Jr. This, rightfully so, right now, is a touchdown. This number 31, dude, he might be the best safety in football. Watch this makeup speed. He's beat right here. There's nothing you can do right here. And if you're a DB, the one thing you can't do is panic. But all he does is wait for this receiver to stick his hands out long foul ball. Just watch the end of this play. Watch Antoine Winfield. He knows that he can only do one thing. Either tackle this guy before he scores or don't panic and make a hell of a play. Let's Riverside to the other side of the ball. All right, 13, Mike Evans, goes out some point in the second quarter. And I gotta tell you, Devin Tompkins stepped up. We know what Devin Tompkins showed in the preseason. We'll finally get a game week four where he's showing what he can do in regular season. Here we go. The Saints are playing zone coverage because you see nobody's moving with the motion guy when Devin Thompson goes in motion. Perfect call for this. So you get Mike Evans on the top side, but you can use Devin Tompkins in this role. He's great at reverses, gadget guy, however you want to describe these extracurricular plays that offenses want to incorporate these days. He's perfect. He's quick, he's agile, he's tough as hell. Watch him finish this run right here. It's like, eh, I can go down right here before two guys hit me, but you know what? I'm just gonna run through them, first down. All right, why do I, why do I explore, why am I exploring this? Because this is, to me, the biggest third down of the game. So the Saints are in a must stop situation, third down, you're gonna play man to man. Man to man right here, there's man to man right here. These two guys are man to man. Obviously man to man, man to man. This defense is called one lurk. And by one lurk, it's all those mans. And then this guy right here is lurking down here. Who do you think he's looking for? Like I said, Mike Evans is out of game. They're looking for Chris Godwin, right? They're looking for Chris Godwin. We're not gonna let Chris Godwin get this ball. So when you watch this play develop, if you're watching down at the bottom of the screen, you know, you might wanna think that this ball might be going to Chris Godwin, but he's getting doubled down here. So let's look at the top of the screen where there's one-on-one, -on -one, guaranteed one-on-one. -on -one. Man at the line of scrimmage, man at the line of scrimmage. Devin Tompkins is gonna go like, this guy's going here, he's gonna go here, and this guy has to go over the top. This corner has to go over the top because it could be to the sticks, first down. But watch this route. Uh, 30, stick, and perfect timing, first down. And then this might be my favorite play of the day because it showcases a lot of what's going right with the Bucks right now on offense. Number one being your quarterback, Baker Mayfield. He is staying alive, staying alive. Ah, 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 staying alive. That's him. Again, it's third and five, and the Saints are gonna play man to man. So this is man, this is man, this is man up here. They have another safety up here in the top of the field looking for Chris Godwin, because why wouldn't you throw the ball to the best receiver on the field? Mike Evans is out. Look at Chris Godwin. Watch all these people play Chris Godwin. All right, he's playing Chris, he's playing Chris. This linebacker you're gonna see try to play Chris. Chris is triple teamed on this play. Triple teamed, right? 
The last play was the catch, or the route. This one is the throw. Watch this throw. When Baker Mayfield throws this ball, where is 83? He's right there, middle field. He may have missed number one right here. Number one could have been wide open in the middle of the field for a touchdown. Right there, that could have been a touchdown. But he just waits, 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 scramble, scramble. Stay alive, stay alive, six, stay alive. And then watch this throw. When he lets go of this ball, all he's seeing is a black shirt covering up 83, and he just lets it go. That's so awesome. Great play, touchdown. Bucks take the lead, it's a big lead, it's a great throw. Baker Mayfield. Devin Tompkins is the hero. A couple of great plays, it's a team effort, and uh, I'm on your team for film session. And next week, we're not doing anything, we're taking a bye. But after that, Detroit, hottest team in football. I'll be here, and we'll break it down again. Cheers, guys.